The day after disaster struck Montecito, mud and stormwater covered Highway 101, the main road connecting Los Angeles and Santa Barbara. Work crews in heavy trucks, fire engines, and police cars were the only vehicles plying the normally busy highway, which could now remain closed for days. The force of Tuesday's mudslides smashed metal barriers and swept cars downstream from the canyons above. Residents described a terrifying night of pouring rain and roaring flood. The sound was boulders and huge boulders because after storms like this, you can go down the creek and there's boulders the size of Volkswagens left, left behind. 80-year-old Bernard Sandler and his wife tried to walk to a pharmacy to get his heart medicine, but they got stuck in thick, unyielding mud. Two hours later, we're still standing up to our middle of our thighs in mud, and my wife almost fell into it, and I thought she would die, and I actually... Huh. I'm married. <laughs> I'm sorry. been married 57 years this month, and I thought I was going to lose her. And I really felt that we weren't going to make it out alive. Many of the roads in the narrow canyons around this area are so badly damaged, the only way to rescue stranded residents is by helicopter. A U.S. Coast Guard Jayhawk helicopter rescued a marooned family of five, including a newborn baby and two pet dogs. On Wednesday afternoon, local authorities gave an update. We realize that this is going to be a long and difficult journey for all of us and for our community. Uh, we ask for your patience, we ask for your understanding, and I ask you for your prayers. People here have lived through nature's one-two punch, first wildfires, then floods. Californians are jaded people. <laughs> They've seen it all. That's an attitude that will, no doubt, be valuable in the days ahead as the cleanup continues. Rob Reynolds, Al Jazeera, Montecito, California.